Hey, welcome back to my YouTube channel, y'all. I'm going to get a quick message out for you guys. I hope the message does resonate in every which way, shape, or form that it needs to resonate for you. If you liked my vibe, give this video a thumbs up. And also, leave me a comment down below and let me know if the message does resonate, y'all. Welcome to my new subscribers and welcome back to my returning ones. Hey, <laughs> I hope everybody is having an amazing sun Saturday. Oh my God, I do not want to rush it. I do not want to rush it. Amazing Saturday, y'all. It's snow here, but it was okay. It was all right. <laughs> so let's jump right into the messages, y'all. What are the messages? Oh God. What are the messages? I haven't used these cards in a minute, so they're kind of... We got the Queen of Wands and the Reverse coming out. We have the Knight of Swords. We have the Ace of Wands and the Reverse. We have the Lovers. We have the Three of Wands. And we have the Eight of Pentacles in the reverse. At the bottom of the deck, we do have the Seven of Swords. So right off the back, y'all, so there's a Queen of Wands in the reverse. Um, a, a witchy, lustful, <laughs> uh, conniving, evil... Uh, could even be jealous, a female that is like trying to block someone's love options or trying to delay someone from mm, trying to delay something. Something about a love option for someone. Like, I don't know if somebody is trying to like get away from this Queen of Wands in the reverse or. But they're, like, trying to make this person, like, unmotivated to leave them in some sort of way. Very strategic. Very strategic. What's this Queen of Wands in the reverse and a Knight of Swords? <laughs> wow. Seven of uh, Swords in the reverse coming out. And we got the Eight of Wands. What's the Seven of Swords in reverse and Eight of Wands? We got the Seven of Cups. King of Cups at the bottom of the deck. Uh, bottom of the deck. So this Queen of Wands in the reverse is like trying to confuse maybe a King of Cups energy. Um, place the roles where they fit. Please do not make the story fit if it does not fit. Okay. But this Queen of Wands in the reverse is like trying to manipulate. Um, tr she's trying like different approaches to manipulate a King of Cups. Could be trying to confuse them or something. It's like somebody is wanting to like leave, move away from this person, go a different route. But this person, this Queen of Wands in the reverse is really trying to manipulate the way this person is seeing something or something about a message. They're trying to, like, there's, oh, wait, this person is conniving. This person is conniving. What's the Ace of Wands and the Reverse and the Lovers? Like, they're trying to delay some, some this is giving me, like, the, so whoever this person is dealing with, it's giving me, like, this person is wanting to go a different route, leave this person. Like, it's kind of giving me, like, they, they kind of see this person for who they are. And this Queen of Wands in the reverse is like trying to manipulate them to like see them in a different light or not, mm, not leave them. We got the Knight of Pentacles coming out. De definitely trying to slow somebody down. We got the Tower in the reverse. This, this Queen of Wands in the reverse energy okay it's really trying to delay whoever they're with we got the nine of swords at the bottom of the day she is trying to she or he place the roles as they fit 
um, is trying to delay whoever they're with from going towards somebody else. With the tower in the the Knight of Pentacles, like they're really trying to slow down this person from leaving them and going to whoever it is that they want to go towards. She, this person is trying to prevent a tower. What's the Knight of Pentacles and the tower in the reverse? And like I said, y'all, the tower is gonna fall, honey. The tower is gonna fall. It's like, you can prolong it all you want. It's gonna fall. We got the star in the reverse. I don't feel like we got the moon in the reverse at the bottom of the day. Like, whoever this person is with, they are seeing them for exactly who they are. Conniving, evil, lustful, witchy. Like, they're seeing them for exactly who they are. This person is like losing faith in getting whoever this is to stay with them. Moon in reverse. Like, it's some sort of what, whatever way of being that they were putting off that they were. It's, it's not a secret anymore. What's the Three of Wands and the Eight of Pentacles in the reverse? We got the Three of Cups. Yeah, somebody definitely want to move away. They definitely, they're looking in the direction of someone else. And like, this Queen of Wands in the reverse knows it. What's this Eight of Pentacles in the reverse? We got the Ten of Cups. I mean, sorry, the Ten of um, Pentacles. We got the Five of Swords at the bottom of the day. So this person, this Queen of Wands in the reverse person, okay, um, it's like keeping this person stuck, I'm going to say, like with partying and partying and maybe even money like this is giving me like a real like conniving like persuasive type of energy like they're persuading this person with things objects it is like kind of making this person um that they're with like have no motivation to leave in a sense if you get what i'm saying it's like because they're bribing them Basically keeping this person stuck. What's the three of cups and a ton of pentacles? And I don't know if like... Oh, what's this three of cups and a ton of pentacles? Somebody want to out of something, but... <laughs> they're being bribed? Yeah. Four of wands. Page of Wands at the bottom of the day. Like, whatever they're doing is, like, working. I don't know if these people are married. These people could be married, if not married, just in a, a committed relationship. Also, what I'm getting from the Four of Wands card as well is giving me, like, these people are, like, together for what it looks like. I really feel like this Queen of Wands in the reverse is like trying to keep up some sort of image. Because it's just like, if this person that they're with walks away or whatever, it's like some sort of tower is going to fall. And it's like, whatever they're portraying their relationship to be, because it's kind of making me seem like these people are in a relationship that they portray, like, for example... Um, you're with somebody and you're, you know, I'm going to put like a Beyonce and Jay-Z, you know, people be looking at them like they're perfect. Oh, they, they don't go through anything, even though, you know, we seem to elevate the scene and all of that, you know, whatever. But they look at them like, oh, they're perfect. They meant to be together. But behind closed doors, like they probably don't even like each other. And I'm not even saying for Beyonce and Jay-Z. Could be, could be not. I don't know. But it's like these people, they put up like some sort of facade. Like, okay, we're just this couple. We're the couple. And then when they get home, it's just like chaos. They don't even like each other. Like, they're trying to like 
keep up some sort of whatever. But I'm, it's making me feel like whoever this Queen of Wands in reverse is with, they're like kind of tired of it. They're like kind of see the relationship going nowhere. And they won't out. But this person like confuses this person, surrounds them with like partying, maybe even drinking, maybe even money, bribing them like to stay in like a relationship they don't want to be in. What's the seven of cups? It's definitely got some, yeah. The four of wands, the, the four of wands, again, the fool. Like this person, like this queen of wands in the reverse is like really putting up illusions around this person. Making them like hold back with the sun. What the, what's the fool? <laughs> with the ace of swords. Mm, mm, mm. What's the fool in the reverse and the ace of swords? We got the six of cups. So I don't know if like they, 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 they uh, I can't even talk y'all. We got the justice at the bottom of the deck. This could be like some, a couple that's been together for a while. Like they're like, and I ain't even got the debit card, but it's kind of giving me like codependency. It's like they're codependent on each other. You know what I'm saying? It's really making me feel like this Queen of Wands in reverse is very codependent. Very codependent. I'm also getting that. This is crazy. I'm also getting that this Queen of Wands in reverse is like telling this person who they with. Like lies to confuse them though. They're like telling them things, but not telling them the whole truth, if, if that makes sense. What's this star in the reverse? What's the star in the reverse? We got the three of pentacles. And what's the three of pentacles? We got the emperor. We got the strength at the bottom of the day. Whoever this emperor's emperor is, they are, they have no like desire to work with this person anymore. They don't at all. They don't have no faith in the relationship. They're tired of pretending. They don't want, they, I don't know what this queen of wands does, but this queen of wands in the reverse does something that this emperor is not proud of. And I feel like it's something that they do that they're scared of, of getting out. And the emperor is like not wanting to be a part of this because if it comes out, whatever it may be, he's going to go down for it too because he's connected to this queen of wands in the reverse. Hmm. What's the three of pentacles and the emperor? We got the temperance coming out. We got the six of wands at the bottom of the day. It's giving me this emperor just deals with a lot of things that this queen of wands in the reverse throws at them. They deal with it. I don't know if, I don't know why it's giving me a blackmail type of thing. It's giving me like this emperor got something behind the scenes that he don't want to be, you know, he don't want out as well. And it's like, if they try to leave this person, they might out them. So he's trying to like keep the peace is what I'm getting. What's his temper? We got the world in the reverse. Yeah. It's like if this person, yeah, we got the two of wands. It's like this queen of wands sees something or knows something that this emperor don't want out. So it's like they're stuck in a hard place, okay? They're like, they're stuck in a hard place. They don't, with the, the world in the reverse, they feel like it will never be over with this queen of wands. It will never be over. It's, it's how he's feeling, honestly. What's this for of wands? 
We got the Wheel of Fortune. And what's this Wheel of Fortune? We got the Five of Swords in the reverse. So whoever this, um, we got the Two of Pentacles at the bottom of the deck. Whoever this emperor is like wanting to go towards as a love interest or they got somebody that they know because this queen of wands in the reverse knows <clears throat> they know that this emperor wants like to go towards somebody else or or is looking at someone else or whatever the case may be i really feel like they got some sort of contract okay when i say contract i mean it like Okay, we ain't together. We might dibble and dabble a little bit here and there. Okay, but we're not together. <clears throat> we're together, but we're not together. And it's like, I don't know what it is, but it's like, it's giving me this queen of wands in the reverse. Don't want them to go towards a particular person. Uh, person. I feel like they're fine with them messing around with anybody else, but I feel like it's a particular person that this queen of wands in the reverse don't want them to go towards. They don't. And I feel like it's somebody that they've been with before. Because with the Wheel of Fortune and the Five of Swords in the reverse, they're they're they are successful with not having this emperor reconcile with whoever it is they want to go back towards. And it's kind of giving me like they keep them in toxicity. They keep them in a low vibration. They keep them partying, wanting to go out. It's like they're trying to like take their mind off of or whatever. But honestly, I don't feel like it's working with the two of pentacles at the bottom of the deck. I feel like it's kind of being shaky now. Like it's like they were able to like get into this person's head to, you know, whatever keep something over this person here for them. but uh, it's kind of shaky now it's kind of giving me the emperor is like really not feeling it anymore and really like don't care at this point whether they got something over their head or not what's the will of fortune and the five of swords in the reverse <clears throat> we got the nine of wands coming out and what's this nine of wands we got the page of pentacles so yeah we got the justice at the bottom of the deck like i said this this queen of wands in reverse has been through a lot trying to keep this person from not reconciling reconciling with a specific person they've been through a lot and with the page of pentacles it's like they don't they they're running out of ideas is like they're they're not they're coming to like a conclusion where they're not able to keep this going. They're not able to keep this emperor away from whoever they're trying to go towards with the justice at the bottom of the day. It's like it's getting harder and harder for them to distract this emperor from going towards whatever love choice he's trying to go towards. What's the six of cups? We got the five of wands. And what's this five of wands? Yeah, we got the knight of cups. We got the ace of cups at the bottom of the deck. Y'all, I can't make this up. These people like fight over this emperor going towards who they want to go towards. And this is like a messy, this is a messy situation. This is messy. This is very codependent, especially this queen of wands in reverse. I don't know what they got going on. I don't know if they got a business going on. They work together in some some form or whatever. But they this person is really trying to keep this masculine away from their choice of a lover. And it's not giving me anything because it's, it's kind of giving me we together and out in the public, but we're not. You know, once once the cameras go off, once nobody's watching, we're not together. And this is what it's giving me. So it's like they can go and sleep with and mess with whoever they want to go sleep with and mess with. It's something about this particular lover that they want or not lover. This particular person that they want to go towards as a love choice. And they fight about this. They fight about this emperor 
going towards this person because this emperor have some a lot of love for this person with the ace of cups at the bottom of the deck. They fight about it. What's this? What's this five of wands and the knight of cups? This is five of wands and a knight of cups. We got the, the high priestess in the reverse. We got the queen of pentacles at the bottom of the day. So this queen of wands in the reverse knows like whoever like they, they're wanting to go towards. Because I really feel like whoever they want to go towards is very stable. Okay. Very about their business. Very nurturing. You know, it, it's just different. They're very different from this Queen of Wands in the reverse. Like, this is very codependent. This Emperor sees that somebody has it all together on their own. They can do it by themselves. And they're looking at this Queen of Wands like, you can't do nothing without me. Like, you don't, you don't, you don't, you, you don't have it on your own. You need someone. You know what I'm saying? And then we got the High Priestess in the reverse. What's going on here? What's the High Priestess in the reverse? We got the devil in the reverse. What's the high priestess in the reverse and the devil in the reverse? We got the nine of pentacles in the reverse. Hmm. We got the two of wands at the bottom of the day. So this queen of wands in the reverse, you know, they, this person is very conniving. <laughs> She's she she got some sort of hidden agenda, okay? And the hidden agenda is that she knows whoever this person is going towards is going to make this person a better person. You know what I'm saying? This person is it just because of the, who this person is. They go, this person is going to make this emperor a better person. They're not going to want to do the underhanded things or the illegal things, you know, that this Queen of Wands in the reverse gets into. Also, I feel like the Emperor gets into it too because they're connected, but I feel like the Emperor doesn't even want to be a part of this anymore. They don't want to be a part of whatever it is no more. But with the Nine of Pentacles in the reverse, the Devil in the reverse, and the High Priestess in the reverse, this person can't even be a dark high priestess as well. They probably can get into things like that as well. But they don't want this emperor to free themselves. They don't want this emperor to grow. You know what I'm saying? They don't they want this person to like stay stuck and bound to them. Because if this per if this emperor go off and go towards whoever they want to go towards, this Queen of Wands know it's giving me they know who it is. They got to know who it is, okay? They know who it is. They know this person can stand on her own too. And this queen of wands in reverse know that they can't, okay? So it intimidates them. They know if this person, this emperor goes towards whatever and leave this queen of wands out in the cold, they're going to be unstable. Emotionally, financially, mentally, whatever the case may be. They're going to, they need this emperor for stability, they do. And this Queen of Wands see that though. They see it. They if they, they see it, if this part if this emperor, they're saying like if this if they go towards them, then what what am I supposed to do? Giving me very codependent vibes, y'all. Codependent vibes. What's this world in the reverse? What's this world in the reverse? We got the judgment in the reverse. We got the judgment in the reverse. And we also have the seven of wands at the bottom of the day. What's this judgment in the reverse? Oh. Jesus Christ, it's too many. Oops, turn it around. What's this judgment in the reverse? We got the moon in the reverse. We got the eight of swords at the bottom of the deck. So this emperor, 
it's like while they're trying to keep the peace with this queen of wands energy okay they're ignoring some sort of calling as well it's like and it's because it's something with this moon some sort of secret is out or they know about this person what is going on what's this moon in the reverse What's this moon in the reverse? We got the six of swords in the reverse. What's the six of swords? We got the king of pentacles in the reverse. We got the death at the bottom of the deck. This emperor know like he went the complete wrong way okay he he know he did i don't know if whoever he's trying to go to now he was with this person i don't know because it's not out here it's not giving me nothing about the person that he wants to go towards it's mainly just focusing on this queen of wands and this emperor queen of wands in the reverse and this emperor it's like this emperor now, because he didn't go towards the person he wants to go towards, okay? Because he didn't, he feel like he's stuck in whatever this is. He feel like he's stuck. Knowing that he know what this person is about, what this Queen of Wands is about, what they, you know, he know what they get to because they, they do it together. Gotta be. But it's like, this person is like ignoring some sort of calling. Like this person is not on the right path. This emperor, they're not on the right path. And I don't know, this gotta be codependency because it's like, why aren't you going to pursue what you want to pursue to make you happy? Why do you feel the need to stay stuck to this person? Okay, could be some sort of blackmail. Could be. Could be. But it, this emperor has secrets as well. And I feel like he's afraid of those coming out as well. And this is why he stays stuck. Because you're not stuck. You're not. Nobody's stuck. You can literally get up and walk out the door. It's something that's keeping you stuck. Okay? You're letting something keep you stuck. King of Pentacles in a reverse. Like, this person is, like, losing stuff. This person is not on the right path. They're not. Eight of Swords in a reverse. King of Pentacles in a reverse. They're falling from grace dealing with this Queen of Wands in a reverse, and they know it. They know they should have never went towards this person they knew they should have just been trying to go towards common waters but they chose to i don't know if it was money i don't know if it was a get rich fast type of thing with these people but now this emperor like kind of want to get on the right path go the other way and it's like he can't he want to transform but it's like he can't or you feel that way, at least. What's this nine of wands and the page of pentacles? We got the two of swords in the reverse. And what's this two of swords in the reverse? We got the queen of cups. Mm, we got the th uh, uh, four of pentacles. Okay. So here we go. Here's the Queen of Cups. Here's who, here's who the Emperor is trying to get to. Trying to get to a Queen of Cups energy. What's this Two of Swords and a Reverse and a Queen of, and a Queen of Cups? What's going on here? Oh, where'd you go? We got the strength. 
<laughs> we got the eight of swords at the bottom of the deck. So, of course, the queen of wands in the reverse does know, like I said, they do know that they want this queen of cups badly. With the strength? Badly. They want them badly. And it puts them in their head about this. It's like because they're losing grip of this emperor. They're losing grip of this emperor. They're losing it, okay? And I don't know what these people are doing, but this Queen of Wands in reverse is into like manipulation, confusion, illusions, and trying to keep people stuck and stuff like that. What's the strength? They done aligned themselves with the wrong one. Like, if they, if they did this out of lust, oh, wait. We got the justice. Like I said, like I said, we got the Queen of Cups here, okay? The strength and the justice, okay? With the Three of Swords at the bottom of the day, this Emperor is very broken hearted that he can't have what he want. It's like, it's like, you know how you want something so, so bad and you can't have it? Just think about that feeling. You want something so bad. You want something so bad to work out and it's not, or you find out that it's not, or you didn't get the position or you didn't get this. It's that feeling. It's just like, damn. <clears throat> It's just like, damn. But I want to know what this strength and this justice is. What is this? What's this strength and this justice? Because do this queen of cups want this person? What's this? Ooh. Hang on a second. What's this strength and the justice? What's this strength and the justice? Oh. We got the Hermit, and we got the Eight of Cubs. Mm. We got the Five of Cubs at the bottom of the day. No, I don't think so. This Queen of Cubs actually walked away from this Emperor. So I don't know if this Emperor was messing with this Queen of Cups on the side. This Queen of Cups could be you. Man or female, take it how it resonate. I don't know if y'all did some soul searching. Y'all went within, said it wasn't for you. Maybe you found out he had a sad chick, which was this codependent Queen of Wands energy. And maybe the Emperor fell in love with you. The Emperor could be a male or a female as well. Place the roles where they fit. Could have been dealing with a um, fire sign. But you could have um, did some soul searching and just chose to walk away. Like, it was something about you being disappointed with this person. What's the hermit and the eight of cups? We got the King of Swords. And what's the King of Swords? It's like you made a head over heart decision. It's like you had to walk away. I'm not sure if they didn't want to walk away from this Queen of Wands because, like I said, if, they, if they're feeling stuck now, I mean, then they were stuck then. What's the King of Swords? With Ace of Pentacles in the reverse. Four of Swords. It's like you, like, really, you walked away from this person. You isolated yourself. You just looked at it like, okay, they missed the opportunity. You were the opportunity, okay? You probably told this person, like, look, you could have known about this. You could have found out about this Queen of Wands. You did. At some point, you found out about this Queen of Wands in the reverse. And if you didn't find out, this emperor was really trying to keep it a secret, but it's kind of making me feel like you did find out. And this is what made you walk away. This is what made you 
self-reflect. This is what made you say, uh-uh, I'm too strong for that. I don't need that. Like, if you gonna be with him, I mean, if you gonna be with her, her, and her, then you just gonna choose you. And and went in isolation. And I don't blame that. You made a head over her decision. Oh, he missed the opportunity. And what's the King of Wands? I mean, King of Swords and an Ace of Pentacles in reverse. We got the King of Wands. And I just said that. And it come out. And what's the King of Wands? We got the Chariot and we got the Sun. And we got the Knight of Wands. Okay? So it's like when you walked away from this person after... And if you did deem this was a missed opportunity, baby, it's not. If, if, and this is for the people who, who did. Like, it, it wasn't a missed opportunity. You were the missed opportunity. You were. Okay? You were. So when you walked away, you, mm -mm. you, you start like leveling up quick, quick with the chariot, with the knight of wands, with the sun, with the king of wands, like you start leveling up quick. You start realizing like, I don't know. You, you felt like this person was a block. Like you had more time to get into the things that you wanted to get into. More time to work on yourself. Because it, it's like, it's kind of giving me, this person had this queen of wands on the side or whatever the case may be. They're used to this person being codependent, okay? So they're used to this person needing them, wanting them, you know, all of this extra bullshit. And they thought you were going to be that way. They wanted you to be that way. So they thought by, you know, because this person won't leave them alone, they felt like you would never leave them alone. But it's like, you're not built that way. You're not built like a queen of wands in the reverse. You're a queen of cups. You heal yourself. You heal others. You're very caring. You're very kind. And I really feel like you showed this person how kind and caring you could be. But then when you walked away and took it back, it's like, they had to, they, they didn't have you anymore. So they had to revert back to this Queen of Wands energy and take that energy. And it's like, this ain't the energy, you know, that I'm used to. You know what I'm saying? Because it's like, I feel like when this person was like, was with this person or this Queen of Wands would be nagging or, or they just wanted to get away from this Queen of Wands person. It was like, you were there, you know? Even if you didn't know this Queen of Wands at the time, you didn't know that this person was in the picture or not. But it's like, they were like using you because you're healing. You're very healing. They were using you to like, for safe space, if you get what I'm saying. And then when they want to feel like they want to be toxic, because they knew you won't for it. You, they knew, I mean, they knew you. They knew your aura. They knew you won with the bullshit. So it's like, they would go back, or oh, well, when I want want toxicity, or well, I want to argue just to argue, they would go back to this Queen of Wands. Kick it with them for a minute until they get on their nerves. Then, no, no. And I don't know if you knew that or not, but you like, no. Mm -mm, I'm good. I'm all the way good. So, yeah. Now I really feel like you're being viewed as the missed opportunity while this person has to deal with the Queen of Wands in the reverse on a day-to-day -day basis. They have no escape. They have nobody who can show them the hit. I don't know what happened, y'all. It just cut off. Mm, best thing want me to talk. But I'm going to do my big one, okay? <laughs> All right. So what's this chariot in the sun? And then I'm about to end it, y'all, because I don't know. I probably ain't got no space. <laughs> what's this chariot? We got the four swords. Like, yeah. After you heal, you you know, you let it go. You say it is what it is, okay? You went in solitude. You start working on yourself, which is a good thing. What's the four swords? We got the page of wands coming out. <laughs> and we also have the magician coming out. Like, you start receiving good news. Like, you were no longer suspended. It's like, it was like a big relief just lift up over your shoulders. You start receiving good news. Like, you are the magician. You had everything it took to manifest you a new beginning away from this person. And that's just what you did. That's what you did. You started feeling like this person was like 
keeping you suspended, keeping you blocked. Like the same way this Queen of Wands is doing, is, what this Queen of Wands is doing to this Emperor. That is so crazy, y'all. Because the only three people out here is the Queen of Wands in the reverse, the Emperor, and the Queen of Cups. Mm. But yeah, you start like no, they were like a block to you. And I feel like you start realizing they were. And when you actually chose yourself and you walked away and you said, I'm 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 too high of vibration to be involved with this low vibrational stuff that they got going on, you start being blessed. Like you start being blessed. Because I really feel like they were like kind of leeching off of your healing energy. Because they had somebody sucking theirs. Queen of Wands was sucking their energy and they was coming to you to refuel. Okay? Once they refuel, feel all energized. Like the energized bunny. <laughs> they went on back to the toxicity. So this person could drain them some more. And you know what? I don't even... Honestly... I don't know. I ain't even gonna say that, y'all. Because who knows? Could be. Could have been a team effort thing. Take it how it resonates. Could have been. But yeah, now that you are receiving good news, you are manifesting. You are doing your big one. Now this emperor is looking over at you like, damn, they were the better choice. But they knew you were the better choice. They're just used to codependent people. They're used to it. And they felt like they could have their cake and eat it too. And you said, no, 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 no. Not over here. You can't have your cake and eat it too. Either you're going to want to be with me or you're not. And since they couldn't make up their mind, you made up their mind for them. And you chose to walk away. And you chose to create a brand new beginning for yourself without them in it. Some of you could be married now. Some of you could be in a committed relationship now. Very happy. Receiving good news. Probably got a promotion, a new job. Good things are happening. All right, y'all. My camera want to act real funny, so I got to end this video. But yeah, y'all, like I was saying, y'all could have just ran into a lot of things that was really making you guys happy. That was really um, uplifting you. Good things, you know? Good things, things, good things start happening to you. You know what I'm saying? Fast. Man, your manifestations was rolling in. Okay, y'all. I don't want the the video to stop again. So y'all, if y'all like this reading, if the reading resonated, uh, if the reading resonated, please leave me a comment down below and let me know. Also, like this video if you like it's my vibe, y'all. I really hope the reading did resonate for you guys. Um, also, I really want to thank everyone for clicking onto my video, watching my video, showing me so much love, y'all. I love y'all. I love y'all. I love y'all so much. I cannot express it enough. Okay, y'all? So, yeah. Until the next time, y'all, I will see y'all in the next video. Bye.